Hey guys, it is day number five of 366. My name is Alan Thomas and I have Rethink Dying for Men, part of Transform My Future. And it is Christmas day. So I hope for a Christmas evening. I hope you guys had a great Christmas. And I was thinking about this um, today, you know, what I would talk about. I mean, so many of you guys are uh, with family and uh, it's always, if you Christmas at your house is like Christmas at my house. It's always about a lot of food is around. And I remember when um, in, you know, prior to 2017, when I lost 129 pounds in 260 days, I always thought the day, you know, around Christmas, you know, you've been through Thanksgiving, you've been through all the Christmas festivities and all the things like what now? I mean, I was already 50 pounds, 75 pounds, 100 pounds, 120 pounds, 129 pounds overweight. How in the heck was I going to tackle this? And, I, and it was always, okay, I'll, I'll just tackle it next week, you know, when I, after New Year's, and I'd make that New Year's resolution. And that would last sometimes as much as a week or two, but typically an hour or two was, was the common theme. And I was, because I was always looking for this magical diet that would that would get the weight off of me and then it became to the point where the weight was just holding me back in so many different ways it wasn't just the the physical side of you know the health concerns that come with morbid obesity but it had a lot more to do with just mentally and emotionally how you feel when when you're that big and then when everybody's eating around you just like there's no way that i can get past this so you know, for me, it was, it was a big change to, you know, be able to control what I was doing day in and day out. Does it mean I never had anything, you know, any, any of the treat, good treats and stuff like that? No, but, but when I, when I put my mind towards really what it was costing me, the, the weight that I was carrying, it changed everything. So I want to say to you guys, you know, one of the things that I encourage you to do is go to my, my masterclass RethinkDieting.com, watch that. And I believe it'll encourage you to do something about your weight if you're really struggling with it. Because, you know, the, the idea that there's this perfect diet out there that's going to solve this dilemma that you've had for 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, 40 years. And, you know, and I'm talking to those of you who really the weight is a real struggle. I'm, I'm not talking to you if you're if you got 10 pounds to lose. I'm talking to you with somebody who has a lot of weight that they're carrying and, and that it's become the, to the point where you're ashamed to go outside. A lot of times you feel like it's held you back in your, in your business. You feel like it's held you back in relationships. It's, you know, I mean, I talked to men that have lost literally had their, their marriages end over their obesity, over their unwillingness and inability to get, the weight off that has been challenging them for years and years. And I don't want that to be you. And, you know, with everybody's different, but it, there's so many common themes that I hear among men so that struggle with obesity. So I would just say to you this Christmas night, you know, what, when you're, if you're asking what now, you know, take the, take the next step. And the next step for a lot of you guys is, you know, book a call with me transformmyfuture.com forward slash apply. We'll have an honest conversation. If you haven't watched my um, my 45 minute masterclass, go do that. Go watch that. You can watch it at rethinkdieting.com. It, it'll help you. And, you know, enjoy the time with your family. Enjoy those. And don't make this your last Christmas because you wouldn't get a hold of your obesity. And there's nobody that's out there that that dies from obesity related illnesses that believe that they were going to be at their last Christmas this year. I don't believe, but there's going to be a lot of you that are. So take it seriously, go watch that video, pay attention to it. And, and if you want to get on a call and, and have an honest discussion, book one with me. Now I'll make time available, you know, this weekend, make time available next week because you know, waiting till the first of the year really is, is a habit that people have, but it's really seldom really solves the problem. So at any rate, let's, let's have a conversation and you guys have a merry, merry Christmas. Have a great evening and we'll see you tomorrow.